Srila Prabhupada explains in the Sri Chaitanya Charitamrita that the most important instruction he has given to all his followers is to chant 16 rounds of Japa of the Hare Krishna Mahamantra on a daily basis. People say that it is better to chant eight rounds well chanted than to chant 16 rounds improperly chanted. If we apply that logic, we could say that it is better to chant four rounds well chanted than eight rounds improperly chanted. And if we follow more, we can say better to chant one round well chanted than four rounds improperly chanted. And if we continue with that logic, then it will be better to chant one mantra well chanted than one round improperly chanted. Do you think this is a good logic? We could say then that better not to chant at all because if you're going to chant one mantra improperly, then better stop it. Actually, if we want to become proficient into something, we need to, to practice, we need to do it a lot. For example, if I want to become a world champion in a particular sport, I will need to train on a regular basis. So similarly, if I want to become expert in chanting Hare Krishna with the proper attitude, then I need to do it on a daily basis. And this starts by following the essential instruction of the spiritual master that we are accepting and we are promising at the time of initiation. The Padma Purana states this, that in order to counteract the offensive chanting, we need to chant constantly. In this way, we become naturally mature in the chanting, and then we are able to chant with attention, with respect, with devotion, with love. So this is the process of, of chanting. And actually, if we will chant only one mantra, well chanted, the higher taste we will experience is such that then we won't be able to stop. So then we will not chant only 16 rounds, but we will chant constantly the holy name of the Lord, Kirtaniya Sadaharihi. Therefore, chant more, chant early in the morning, and chant better.